began with an away fixture against Steve McLaren's Middlesbrough, who'd benefited from a large influx of players before the transfer window closed. Cleared by Hunsworth, and while the ball was over the head of Stuart Barnaby and Rosinski has gone away, and he's gone away now from Chris Riggett, and Rosinski has some space to attack, and it's behind Kevin Campbell, and Steve Watson it is. And Steve Watson it is that's opened the scoring. But he scored four in the Premiership already this season. That's goal number five, and it delights the 3,000 travelling away fans. And really, that goal was all about the work of Thomas Rosinski. Yeah, you say what a threat he is. He's done it ever so well there. The, the game seemed to stop Riggett. I'm not sure if he thought somebody was coming behind him, but he, he seemed to stop and go. He's been done by a great bit of skill from Rosinski. Gets a bit fortunate to deflection. Campbell does ever so well. I'm still expecting a tackle from Frank Quadriere. He maybe could have been a bit stronger there, but. Watson's in a bit of goal scoring form and he's, uh, he's got the brief. Nice touch that way, Kevin Campbell. It was a nice touch, but you think Quedro's got to be stronger there. Really mincing that he wasn't in there, Watson. Maybe Barrow can do something here. It's with George Bote again. He has Macaroni and he has Ricketts as well. This is Ricketts. Macaroni in some space now, if he can get it across. The header was away by Amsworth, and now Everton with a chance to break themselves. The ball through the middle, aimed towards Wayne Rooney. And Rooney's still goal, and Rooney's put it just wide of the post. A let off. I mean, once he got out of that position, he, he, for all you money, he expected him to score. Takes it down ever so well. Takes it to, just gets caught on this running crack. It's a great save until it can start again. A valuable point which took the Blues back up to four. next and on the back of two successive victories with survival being the hammers only objective Goodison witnessed only its second goalless contest of the season and they're down by Ferdinand it's a good one too to Sinclair who tries to pot you up and it's a good save from Richard Wright and eight minutes into the second half we've seen the real first shot at goal Ravison's ball up and looking for Watson. Great turn from Watson. What can he do from here? Inside, shot in his left foot. Hibbert. Tio's ball is a good one to Radzinski. Right into his path. Nobody hanging short on the edge of the penalty area, so the cross the only end result. Hibbert and the header in from Stubbs. Well, you were just expecting the net to balls there. And Stubbs won probably with Everton's best chance of the game so far. It's a harsh clearance from David Weir. Will it drop for Radzinski? Does well, just pops it into the path of Wayne Rooney. Tries to go by Pierce Wayne Rooney on his right foot. The shot was blocked. That's a great effort on goal, and probably Everton's best effort on goal of the whole day. Frustrating afternoon with West Ham certainly leaving the happier of the two teams. As March drew to a close, just two points out of a possible nine, so the Blues slipped to six, but still in touch with the leading pack. Began with the visit of Newcastle to Goodison Park. Both teams eager for the points, and with Wayne Rooney returning fresh from a stunning England performance against Turkey, Goodison anticipated a true heavyweight clash. Gravison with the corner into Carsley. Gravison on his right foot this time. Header on. Big chance. In off the post. And you could have written the headline prior to it. Wayne Rooney. Bang. 1 0 to Everton. He's there or thereabouts when you need him. Edge of the six yard box. Great ball in. Flick header. 
And there he is doing the true striker's job. Well, we've seen him score spectacular goals time and time again. But this is a true striker's finish. Great header on, hanging about on the edge of the six-yard box. Flick header gives Everton the lead. David Unsworth. Carsley. Yobo. Everton playing with a bit more panache now. Joseph Yobo. The ball onto the edge of the box. Carsley hangs about. Campbell with the shot. There's a crept under the legs of Shea Given. Almost put Everton two in front. And again, it was swift play from the Blues. Carsley throwing his legs in. And Campbell with the early shot. Woodgate, intelligent there. Great ball as well. Left-hand side, plenty of space for Robert to try the shot. And that is a truly super goal. His fifth strike of the season. And I tell you what, the space that he was awarded on the left-hand side, he's going to punish Everton. But that was a truly special goal from Laurent Robert. And let's go out for the throw-in. He sends the Blues need a goal soon. Might come from Stubbs. Great save. And Stubbs caught ahead of somebody square in the face there, I think. Brave header from Stubbs. Straight into the grateful arms. Well, it was a, a foot in the face. I think it was from Jonathan Woodgate. On oh, Bellamy, quite fortuitous the way it landed here. In real trouble. Great play from Joseph Yobo in clearing it because Shearer was waiting to pull, put the ball in the back of the net. The challenge on Bernard that may be punished later on. Gravison was involved. The referee's all over the place here, and Gravison's gone back to see if Bernard's OK. Play goes on, there's calls for Everton to put it out. Wayne Rooney still in possession for the Blues. He's not giving it up. Into Kevin Campbell. Is that a penalty? Yes, it is. Well, there was confusion all over the park because Gravison and Bernard were both hurt in an earlier challenge. Alan Stubbs, out of your picture, is facing the other way. He can't watch. David Unsworth, it'll be his left foot. You suspect a hammer of a strike, and it's 2-1 to Everton. David Unsworth's number five of the season, and the pressure lifts from Evertonians' shoulders as they regain the advantage here at Goodison Park. A truer strike as you wouldn't see. Shea Given went to his left and Unsworth went at the very centre of the goal. A tremendous victory and one to re-emphasise just where the team's ambitions lay.